And you're uh, quoted in 1962. It's always dangerous to speak to the mm. press because then what's in our, yes. it's in our information. In 1962, as saying that you were very disappointed in Martin Luther King, mm. you know, the man that everybody talks everybody to. Everybody revered sort of the, the yes, yes, yes. essential African American. Yes, I'll never get rid of that. So why were you disappointed in him? Well, I can't remember the specifics, but something we thought was important, he wasn't paying as much attention to as we thought. Uh, we thought that he just wasn't as, he wasn't as militant as we were, mm -hmm. wasn't as willing to risk and dare as we were. And, um, you know, I thought when I said that, I remember thinking when I said that, that we won't hear much more of this guy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he'll, he'll pass off the scene and I somebody else will come along. He said that he was going to just, just going to become just another preacher, yeah, that he wouldn't yeah. be a leader. Right, well, <laughs> yeah. boy, was I wrong. Well. But, but anyway, that was a feeling. We, we felt that in the, in the scale of militants and, and aggressive behavior, and again, we're talking about in a, in a nonviolent context, but on a scale of aggressive behavior, we were first. And he was maybe second or... More cautious. Yeah, more cautious. Mm -hmm. And that you couldn't do this by caution. Uh, you had to be bold. And we were bold and he was not. Mm -hmm.